Hi, I'm Larkin Wyand of Brigham Young University, and I'm here to tell you about a paper I've written with Brent Goff and George Newell of Ohio State University. Our paper is called The Social Construction of Warranting Evidence in Two Classrooms. The purpose of our study was to compare the instructional conversations surrounding the warranting of evidence in two different teachers' classrooms, Ms. Houston and Mr. Clark. We were particularly interested in better understanding how each teacher's differing argumentative epistemologies shape their students' understanding of what it means to warrant evidence. In terms of findings, one teacher, Ms. Houston, favored an ideational epistemology. She taught her students to quickly identify textual details, interpret the ideas represented by those details, establish consensus regarding their interpretation, and deliver the interpretation as academic content in the form of on-demand writing. The other teacher, Mr. Clark, favored a social process epistemology. In his class, a warrant cannot be just sourced, it must be explained. The main objective of Mr. Clark's discourse is to engage students in using evidence to explain one's warrant to a specific audience. Mr. Clark requires students to examine evidence one piece at a time while withholding judgment on the student's interpretations. By not labeling the student's interpretations as correct, he pushes them to be sufficient in how they account for all evidence. In terms of implications, we argue that knowledge of argumentation and argumentative writing is socially constructed by participants in particular contexts. We argue that teachers' argumentative epistemologies shape instructional conversations, a phenomenon easily overlooked if teachers and researchers only consider students' written arguments. We think that the social practice perspective raises significant questions worth pursuing, such as how social systems, such as English language arts classrooms, depend on and promote particular kinds of linguistic, rhetorical, and graphic resources for meaning making. Finally, our project questions the pedagogical value of using test preparation as a writing curriculum. We believe we need more research that studies the social contexts for learning to write. We advocate for research that considers what students are learning about the uses of writing and argumentation beyond the simple deployment of claim, data, and warrant. Thank you.